G'day YouTube, this is just a quick video about what's upcoming and what's new in Linux Mint 19.2. Now at the moment I've got Linux Mint 19.1, uh, so it hasn't actually yet been released in, in beta, so it's a little bit difficult to, to get. Uh, minus a few tweaks that you can do to attempt to get it, but um, in terms of actually what's going to be new, now I'll start off with I guess letting you know what, what's quite normal here. So it will be based on the uh, still on the Ubuntu 18.04 LTS or Long Term Service Base, so nothing's really new there. Uh, Linux Mint, although is is 19.2, uh, is said to include performance improvements to the the Muffin Windows Manager, which is uh, and I guess you could say the aim is to make uh, managing Windows feel more smooth and light as they're uh, quoting them saying there, but things seem okay, and I'm on a virtual machine here, so it's not too bad there. Uh, moving on, uh, it, it will be called Tina. Now, it's following the, the T letter release, so uh, Linux Mint 19.2, Tina will be the name, although that's not really anything new in terms of updates to really speak of. Uh, there is actually going to be some updates to the the update manager, which will be really cool to see it. I think that that is a long time coming. It's a little bit old school for me, just the way that it looks. I've never really been too much of a fan of the update manager, as opposed to, say, Ubuntu, which seems a lot nicer, a lot cleaner there as well. Uh, so also, it will have a, a single uh, click uh, Bluetooth applet, which will be pretty neat. So I'm also looking forward to that one too. Uh, what else do we have? So it's going to have a new logo, or apparently it may have a new logo, a new look in that way. So new releases, new distro releases always seem to do a bit of that too, so that's good to see. And uh, last but not least, from what we know, and as you could even guess with this one, Linux Mint 19.2 will be available in both 32 and 64-bit builds across three distinct editions and that's Cinnamon, Mate, and XFCE. So all of the good distribution versions, desktop environments really, that you've come to see. This one at the moment is of course the uh, the Cinnamon, latest Cinnamon release. It's really cool what they've done here. Very Windows 10 or Windows 8 or 7-esque. So it's not too bad there. I like what they've done there. So that's pretty much it guys. Just a super quick, simple, fun video to give you a bit of a, an insight as to what 19 uh, Linux Mint 19.2 will look like. So as always, I'm quite excited on these channels for these types of updates. So cheers guys, uh, thanks for your time and hope you've enjoyed.